A Bay Area teacher died at a juvenile center and no one noticed for two days. ABC Action News reporter Heather Lee tonight talking to his son who believes there were several signs that the employees there missed. Timothy Guy loved teaching at Central Pasco Girls Academy. He taught when he wasn't teaching here, he was teaching at the jail and he loved helping people take the steps they needed to be more successful in life. Last Saturday, he signed into work, but never signed out. It's heartbreaking. Two days later, Pasco County deputies called Ryan Guy, Timothy's son. His father died of natural causes in the bathroom. No one found him for 48 hours. His son said Timothy's car was in the parking lot and that he handed over his keys when he signed in Saturday morning. Ryan believes those were red flags. He comes in to do his job and there's a, there's a health issue and it, it takes two days for them to find the person that signed in and never signed out. We reached out to the company in charge of the facility, TrueCore. They were looking into the incident and said they would get back to us. But the Department of Juvenile Justice says they are investigating what happened to see if staff followed all of the policies and procedures. Ryan wants to make sure this never happens again. It may not have made a difference in my dad's life, but it could make a difference in someone else's. In Pasco County, Heather Lee, ABC Action News.